In the Mock Channel 4 series The Windsors, where Pippa Middleton seduces Prince Harry, Tom Parker Bowles, the son of Queen Camilla, admits to loving Harry Enfield's portrayal of King Charles. However, Tom vigorously contests the late Hiding Gwyn's depiction of his mother as a chain smoker who swigs gin while hawking his new royal cooking book. It's inaccurate. She had never in her life had a tumbler of gin. Doesn't smoke, he claims, adding that the actress who portrayed his mother passed away. She was incredibly intelligent. But my mom doesn't drink much. Never seen her look so tipsy. Giles Brandreth has revealed to Radio Times that he saw Camilla smoke a woodbine in a bush close to his boarding school, Beedales, Peterborough, and that's how he first confessed to having a teenage crush on her on BBC Radio 4 when she was 17 years old. My wife Michelle and Camilla met at a flower show a few weeks later, remembers Giles. Now, take a look, she urged. Inform Giles that I don't dispute that I was in the bushes and that I was smoking. However, I do not believe they were woodbines. How will Marianne Faithful respond to Redlands? The play about the infamous 1967 drugs bust arrest of Mick Jagger and Keith Richards. She will not be pleased that the play, which debuted in Chichester last night, continues the urban legend that Jagger was stopped by the police eating a Mars bar that was hidden in Faithful's underwear. Marianne described the talk as a nasty old man's fantasy. But Justin Audibert, the director of Redlands, is adamant. We have left it in because it is part of the story. Widower Maurice Saatchi, 78, of Josephine Hart, remembers telling Bob Geldof about his fall romance with 70-year-old Lynn, the widow of his close friend Sir Evelyn de Rothschild. I'm sure Josephine and Evelyn are gazing down at Lynn and thinking, this is very good. I replied, raising my voice to the highest pitch possible. Bob responded, calling it self-serving bull asterisk 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 da. Bob is a relatively straightforward guy. Dame Jilly Cooper says her favorite Disney princess is Snow White. Even if the company has made her 1988 blockbuster rivals into a TV series. If Snow White had met her well-known Lothario character Rupert Campbell Black, how would she have fared? Jilly slyly answers. Well, in the early days he'd have taken her upstairs pretty fast. Did she seem happy or grumpy?